Hi, I'm Shani Moore for Newspaper, and we're here in Nottingham, where it's all about growing your business online. We're going to be hearing from the sales and operational director at Google and the founder of Moonfruit.com about the best techniques and strategies to grow your business online. Why am I happy to be here? Um, well, I'm delighted to have the opportunity to catch up with some friends and colleagues and do a bit of networking. Also, the presentations are really looking forward to. I think it'll be fascinating to hear what Google have got to say about growing your business online. They're obviously one of the, uh, the most successful internet businesses in the world, so I'm sure they'll have plenty of useful tips for you know, how we can increase our internet presence. Um, always attend the events. Um, it's a great networking opportunity, and the, the topic tonight is of particular interest to me. Um, growing a business online I don't know very much about so happy to learn and happy to meet the attendees here tonight. I'm actually quite keen to meet the uh, lady from Moonfruit because uh, I've sort of followed their uh, success so I'd be interested just to hear their stories and experiences. We're talking about how to use social media to grow your business but actually based on case studies of for Moonfruit and Gandhi we've had two very successful campaigns in the last year um, where we were trending both worldwide and in country locations for the two Twitter campaigns. And it's made a big difference to our bottom line. So we wanted to share that with other companies on how they can potentially use social media. Um, we're also going to be talking a bit about, in Moonfruit's case, we kind of raised a lot of money in the dot-com boom, and we managed to barely survive the dot-com crash. So we're going to talk a little bit about how to survive when times are difficult as well, which is kind of appropriate to where we are at the moment in the economy. I think... You know, be passionate about what you're going to do because you're going to do it for a very long time. Um, and, you know, be in it for the long run in a sustainable way. Don't burn yourself out. My key points are to be to try and make everyone aware of what's actually happening in the online market. The whole market is growing, it's developing, and I want to illustrate with some techniques of how people might build their business online and make it more successful for them. It's never been easier to get going. It's always going to be hard to get money behind your, your, your ideas, but the, the world is full of ideas and with the information age it allows you to bring that together and get to decisions much, much quicker. I think there's plenty of hope for entrepreneurs in the future. The internet and all its friends like Google provide us with lots and lots of information. The trick is to turn that information into intelligence and to take action on that intelligence. That's the key thing in the future. Focus on data, focus on intelligence. We've taken a slightly different approach this evening. Rather than having an event that was focused just on how to raise finance and the sources of finance, um, we also, well, this, the theme for this evening was how to grow your business online. Obviously, all investors look for companies with strong online strategies for how they're going to grow their business. Um, it's, it's, it's a phenomenon that's here to stay, and um, we wanted to kind of share some of that information with businesses in the East Midlands, and our two speakers have done a great job in doing that. I think we've learned a lot about the future tonight. It's been brilliant. I think we've had a lot of insight from some real experts, brilliant networking, great investment community. It's probably the best networking organisation in the country. There's a lot more to happen. I mean, we think that what's happening now is all new and different, but then if you, we need to probably start thinking further ahead almost and how that's going to affect our business. Because by the time, if you kind of try and react to what's going on now, you might almost miss what's going to happen in the future. So you, you almost got to start thinking ahead so that when that happens, you're ready because you can't know everything about everything. No one person knows everything about everything and you have to come and listen and take other people's views on board. And I always feel that if you get one thing out of an event like this, then it's well worth the afternoon in coming or the evening in this case. So tonight it's all been about growing your business online and maximizing value, potential and customers. In Nottingham, I'm Shinny Moore for Newspaper.